ICH, thanks for coming out to the clinic. I hope you got a lot out of it. And we are going to start with your underwater here. Uh, a couple of things here. You're gliding real well, but you can see the position of your hands, your elbows down, your hands are up. And you're not in a very uh, streamlined position. And that is a really the main thing that I think you need to work on because you're rotating enough. Uh, you're in a good glide position. So, I mean, you're, 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 uh, you're gliding enough, but the position is not good. So one of the drills I like to use with somebody that has a stroke like yours is the heads up freestyle. You can actually see the hands go in. You can see the position of the elbow, the hand, the shoulder as you're gliding. So you do heads up freestyle and kind of watch the position. But you got to make sure that you're not dropping that elbow like that. Also, the, as a result of the elbow or the, the result of the shoulder, I don't know which one it is, you have a really low shoulder in the water. So those are combination there. Might be that you have a low shoulder, so you're bending your elbow, or the fact you're bending your elbow is making you drop your shoulder. So you really want to try to a uh, little less rotation on the shoulders, keep the hips rotating, but you've got to get that uh, fingertips, elbow, and shoulder straight in a line when you're gliding. That's what's the primary thing that's uh, throwing you off. It's also real hard to pull from a from that position with a low elbow because what happens is it takes you a while for the elbow to get above the hands, which is the proper pulling position. So you're actually starting with a a little bit of a disadvantage there. You're recovering pretty well. See how you're turning your thumbs up and then you're coming back down for your catch. Keep that thumb down right there, particularly on the right. Keep the thumb turned down and the top of the elbow facing above the water. That should help you align that hand. Here's your above water. Elbows are nice and high. Looks good. Looks comfortable and smooth. Maybe over finishing just a little bit. See the hands with the, the hands pushed back behind you. That's the wrong position. You could do, you're doing that with the left arm. You want to finish straight back, not back over the over your hips. See how you're pushing that water back over the hips. You don't want to do that. You want to just push it straight back. You don't want to snap those hands back behind you for the finish. But the bubble water looks pretty good. So. Main thing, straighten that arm out in front, align the fingertips, the hands, the elbow and the shoulder, straight line and you'll be a better glider. Best of luck.